So here you can see uh, in 2008 it was around about uh, 250 billion uh, euros uh, in, the, in the world. Uh, that's the software market, so that is mostly product software, but sometimes also project software is included accidentally. Growth of about 6.5%, and this growth is fairly typical for this uh, industry. Some years it's 9%, some years it's 3%, like in 2009, uh, when nothing grew. Um, so 2013 forecast, uh, 360 uh, billion euros. Uh, what's interesting about the 6.5%, if we were to start a company uh, uh, together at the end of this year, then by the end of next year we would have you know, maybe uh, five or six people extra. So you know, if we just be average, we probably will be uh, very successful because we're all well educated and smart. So we might even go uh, a little bit quicker. Um, so 9% uh, of total ICT uh, expenses, uh, 26 thousand uh, billion euros. Uh, so in the Netherlands, 12 percent is the highest of the world. Um, and also the Americas have 42.6 uh, of the global software market value. Uh, this is very important. Um, most of the software still is coming from the US. Uh, most of what we buy, most of what we use. Uh, large parts of that, of course, are Microsoft, the uh, gaming industry. Those are really uh, uh, eating a lot, a lot of that uh, time. Uh, I say Microsoft, but of course, also other companies, Google. Um, well, here's some nice uh, numbers from 2002, very rapidly growing. Um, quite interesting, the Netherlands uh, exports around 600 million uh, euros in uh, software. That's uh, fairly unique to uh, the Netherlands. There's also uh, Finland, which is also doing quite well. And uh, if you look at the top three, I think number one is Ireland. That's because it's tax technically more interesting to send American software through Ireland. So they're achieving uh, a lot. Uh, so Finland and the Netherlands and Germany are basically the, the top three. Uh, I don't know about the order, probably Germany. Germany's number one because they have SAP and the Software AG and some other big uh, companies. Uh, so around about 15,000 employees in Dutch companies. We estimate about 2,500 companies in the Netherlands that are pure product software, so that are interesting to us. Um, but I've seen also estimates of about 1,500, so it's somewhere in between. Um, and 8.5% of 175,000 total ICT employment. So if you want to work in ICT, there's a 10% chance you'll be working in this particular area. After this course, of course, it's going to be uh, at least 90%, uh, I hope. All right, so the worldwide market. Uh, I don't quite remember this slide. Uh, why is this interesting? Well, here you can see in 2001, 54% uh, see, yeah, of the market is um, still North America. So they're also buying most of the software, and nowadays I think it's more uh, equally uh, divided. All right, so this is quite interesting. Uh, we took a look at, uh, or not we, but uh, the authors of the article uh, behind this, they took a look at uh, uh, four categories, or, or three main categories, uh, system infrastructure software, uh, software development tools, and application software, and they tried to look for different subcategories in there. Uh, interesting is, of course, that application software is the largest. Uh, this is still true. So, uh, Exact Online is a, a much more well-known product than, uh, well, uh, let's say Eclipse, of course, because Exact Online is more widely uh, applicable to my mother's shop uh, or uh, my dad's shop, all both my parents' shops. Um, whereas, uh, ex um, uh, well, other more specific software we can only be sold to very small markets, but maybe at a higher price. Uh, here you see some of the uh, subcategories. So here, let's just take a look at this one. Um, let me see, so across industry business, like ERP, so that's uh, the, the widest category you can take, sort of horizontal. That's this uh, blue one. Um, well, other is this one, so they didn't do very good research here. Uh, Cutcom, so that's computer aided design, computer aided uh, manufacturing. That's this one, so these are quite large markets, in, uh, uh, this is all in terms of uh, dollars. Um, so share of total ICT expenses. Uh, in the Netherlands we are apparently quite tempted to buy products instead of build things ourselves. Um, interesting is that uh, if uh, Japan was in this graph it would be very much at the bottom. Uh, Japan is a country where people still uh, work very much uh, with the, the non invented here syndrome. So uh, people tend to build their own software. It's starting to switch a little bit but uh, well, I think it's quite interesting that in the Netherlands and the States we uh, spent uh, these two countries are the countries that spend the most on products and uh, less on services. Um, oh, here's the uh, OECD average. It's quite nice number. Alright, small and so. Uh, Shaq once said to uh, the students, uh, well, uh, uh, to the entrepreneurial students, he said, oh guys, well, uh, at some point, 
Um, Bill Gates, he sold the MS DOS, but he sold it before it was finished. Basically, he had a signed contract, and that night he was still coding uh, the software for it. And the student, uh, one of the students, replied, Well, he still does. Laughing <laughs> 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 our asses off. Like, that was said. All right. So now uh, we run to the next part, and this is, of course, really important for assignment one. I think I get 